Well, Saturday evening greetings from the city of Cleveland, home of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and home of LeBron James and the Cleveland Cavaliers. He swept the series from the Cavaliers a year ago, three games to none. They won by five and by 12 in South Florida, and by 20 here in Cleveland last March, 102 to 82. Let's take a look at our Southwest Airlines starting lineups for the 14 and 10 Miami Heat, featuring small forward James Posey, who tripled three times last night in Philadelphia. Posey, born and raised in Cleveland, Ohio, he went to high school 20 minutes out of downtown Cleveland in Twinsburg, Ohio. And let's take a look at the 12 and 9 Cavaliers. After the impressive 9 and 2 start, they've won just three of their last 10. And Larry Hughes, the expensive free agent imported from the Wizards, well, the numbers way down for Hughes. He averaged 22 points a game last year. This year, just 16 points per game on 39% shooting. LeBron James, what a talented athlete and ball handler at six feet eight. Guard by Peyton. LeBron fires and hits from the baseline. Philadelphia was on a four game winning streak, out rebounding their opponent by a plus six going into that game. James checks traffic and buries the baseline jumper. So LeBron has five. He was very impressed with Mike Brown when he worked with him as an assistant two years ago with the Pacers. That's still a seven point lead for Cleveland. Ogaskis from the wing. Second hoop for the seventh year center. He'd have hit just one of their first eight shots as Wade fires. Bolta. Wade changing gears all the way in. He got it. Second score for Wade. Miami down by only three now. He would be the starting guard. You know, it's, it's a mixed result. James turns the corner. What a pass. What a terrific pass. That's what separates LeBron. Tremendous court vision. Different than what it used to be at that power forward spot. There used to be post-up players, mid-range shooters. Now they can bury threes. Peyton keeping this drive alive, and Wade with a right-handed stuff. Wade took a hit before he went up. He had to gather himself. Wade swings into the lane. Here's Posey for three. Got it. James Posey tripling for the 38th time this year. Good. Posey crowding LeBron James. And James drills the jumper. He's got nine points. That's exactly what you have to do, though, Eric. You've got to crowd him. Posey backing up for his third rebound. Walker, beautiful pass for Wade, who lays it in on the backhand. And he gave a no-look pass that time. He wasn't looking at Wade, but he saw him at, on the cut. James low post against Posey. Good defense. James made the shot anyway. 11 for LeBron. That takes... Bill Gaskis, he's one of the NBA's premier offensive rebounders. Second in the league. What a wraparound pass for LeBron James stuff. You know what happens, Eric, when you have a great pass on your team like LeBron James. Mention Bill Gaskis at 7-3 from Lithuania. He knows LeBron's going around, and he just, you know, instinctively he knew that LeBron defensive man got caught up. Shandon Anderson got was behind him, and he just led him perfectly with that pass. Yeah, Lono's in at that two guard spot. He's gonna guard, go against Snow. James with a catch and finish. This kid is something else. 16 in the first half for LeBron. Nogaskis, good passing big man. There he leads. That time he did a wraparound before. That time he led LeBron James, and because of his 6'8 height. You know, his, his uh, strength inside, he's able to get up over all the Heat defenders and finish. Seven points for Antoine on three or four shooting from the field. James, bullet pass for Snow. He drove by O'Neal, and the Heat commit the foul on the Snow bucket. If it's on Shaq, it's number three. We've seen many times, Eric, we either Shaq or Wade control the tempo of the game. Well, tonight you've seen a great player in LeBron James controlling this tempo. Foul was on the Diesel, that's his third. Well, the Diesel staying in the game with three fouls. He's scored only two points in 10 minutes so far. Capono for three. Kaboom! <laughs> I like it. Uh, points tonight for the fourth year man out of Kansas, Drew Gooden. Hurt his left ankle, I believe, Eric. He just landed. Ah! Yes, Gooden is down. 
And D. Wade scores to capitalize on the other end. Wade in double figures with 10. And Gooden is a hurting guy right now. Down by 14 now with just under two minutes left in the half. Cavaliers have scored the last seven points. And James off the turnover. Drives all the way in and was fouled. And Wade had to hang on to the rim to prevent a crash landing. So his return is the plus. The play. Second in the league with 11 free throw attempts again. The reason, Eric, is that they can, and, and so far, basically, you got to settle for either the mid range jump. Cavaliers have made 14 of their 18 free throws. James, 9 for 9, 21 points. Wade. Well, he just stilled the net on that one, dropping in the 20 footer. Just under four seconds remaining in this second. 59 points on 54% shooting. He's shooting 42% in this game. The Cavaliers at 55%. Ilgaskis rings it up. Seven points for Zadrew. Well, the Cavaliers' defense has been their weakness, but not tonight. Ilgaskis, 17-footer. Under eight minutes left, third quarter. Heater down 20. And what a steal that was by Hughes. Hughes all the way in. Wade knocked it out. You love that about Dwayne Wade. He didn't hang his head, didn't get upset at himself, ran back, made a good play, didn't, didn't make two mistakes on the play, hustled back and stopped the break. Watch this. Hughes is going to pick his pocket, but we'll look at Wade hustling down the floor. It all starts with that first step, Eric. Peter down 20. 7.40 left in the third. O'Neal, good position down low. He banked that one up and in. Good ball movement by the Heat. D. Wade knew as soon as he caught it that Shaq was in the deep low post. And here comes Posey after a wild sequence. Posey popping, but missing. Ah! Wade on the putback plus the foul. Yes, good play at the other end. Shaq played good defense, position defense on uh, who had made that move a little earlier. Uh, there we go, watch, we'll see this here. Wade on the end of that play and finishing getting the foul. Danielle Marshall at the other end Tried to go on Shaq. Shaq had good position on him, and then it resulted in a three-point play at this end of the floor. Second foul on Ilgaskis. Wade, with his effort here in the third quarter, is basically saying with his body language, guys, follow me. And he down by 15, trying to amp up the defense here. LeBron off the double team, finds Eric Snow for the 18-footer. Well, right now, the Cavaliers doing a very good job of locating the open man. And LeBron James is crowded by the Heat, so he doesn't score, but he gives it up for assists. He's got seven right now. Five points for Snow as Payton fires and hits a corner three. Gary Payton's 22nd triple. And Larry Hughes sending it back to Marshall. In the corner, James, he'll fire a three. Boy, are they capitalizing on their open shots. He usually does. He, he finds his range, then he finds the camera. 19-point lead for Cleveland. Wade drives all the way in with a two-hand stocking stuffer. Man, he looked like he was going to lose the ball twice on that play. Finally gathered it, went over and Wade. Loses. Third, third team foul on the Cavaliers. Sorry, we talked about Wade almost losing the ball twice. Just went in and finished. Let's look at this again. Let's hear it. Miami down by 18, just over two minutes to go. Third quarter as Wade pulls up and knocks it down. Dwayne Wade now with 24. James with 25 points tonight, along with seven assists. Two on the shot clock, DJ, a long three. How did he make that? Dwayne Wade has made 19 of 22 free throws. They had six of seven tonight. By the way, when we were Cavaliers with an eight-point lead, 7.35 left in a suddenly more compelling fourth period. LeBron James driving on Capone, morning there for the help. LeBron James gets the bucket. He has 27. Yeah. Now the Heat will be in a man-to-man -man off that miss. James, pull-up jumper. Yes. 29 for LeBron. Cavaliers by 12. Timeout, Pat Riley and Miami. Good timeout by Coach Riley. He doesn't want them to get momentum or get the crowd back into the game. Heat four in a row. Dwayne Wade on the drive, put it up and in. Dwayne Wade just back into the game. Gets his first points of the fourth quarter. James off the spin. 
Well, Bron James, he's got that mid-range game. At the moment, sixth in the East, Tony the Bazaar, Mike Fratelli. And assistant coach, Ron Rothstein. James also went to college in the state of Ohio at Xavier in Cincinnati. Five on the shot clock, LeBron for three. Well, the threes have decimated Miami tonight. Cleveland has tripled 11 times in 25 tries. LeBron James has scored their last 11 points. Posey, can he answer? Yes, sir. Yes. A triple for Posey, his third tonight. He has three of them in his last five games. Very capable reserve stepping in, doing a terrific job. He stays in that 2-3 zone. The, the defense that got him back into the game. James comes right wing. Tough shot. Oh, my. You believe that man? That young man, 13 points in the fourth quarter. That one full. Dwayne Wade just knocked in the free throw for his 30th point of this game. Yeah. Two possession game, he do not need the foul. Plenty of time left. LeBron with 39 points now. LeBron with 39 points now. Behind Dwayne Wade. Yes, still, right now he's one ahead of Wade. It's still a two possession game. Wade hanging and hitting. Dwayne Wade with 33, and the chase is still on for the win. It's 111 to 107. And Dwayne Wade just three points away from Glenn Rice's highest scoring game against the Cavs of 36. But Miami's down by six, only 11 seconds left. Wade steps back for three. And LeBron James grabbing the rebound from O'Neal and is fouled by Antoine Walker. The Heat had won five of the last seven games against the Cavaliers. You know, Pat LeBron Riley. James, 40 points tonight, Tony. Well, you know Pat Riley wanted all four games on this trip, but a three-and-one road trip is a very successful one. It's going to end the Heat's four-game winning streak tonight, though. So. That shot won't count. LeBron James enjoys his eighth career 40-plus point game. And there you see the respect of the two third-year stars. LeBron James with 41 points and 10 assists. Dwayne Wade, 33 points, 7 assists. The four-game winning streak does end tonight for Miami.